Hello guys, welcome back to Ventilate And guys, we have an hour to go And I am not gonna bother guys I really tried And look, can I actually make it a second? Potentially But You have to remember guys This is just a daily reward You don't wanna go too crazy on it You wanna get what you have to But you don't wanna be insane The reason why I say is that If you look at player number one over here Of my Korean friend he is absolutely smashing it and it probably took him another 20 prestigious to get to where he was which is not slow but here's the question right fine you can get there you can get number one it's 280 and if you win um if you win first place you're gonna get what another 20. for another 20 20 prestigious in your normal game you can easily farm that without even doing so so hence that's why i'm saying you have to be careful you have to know what you're playing with and you got to know when to stop when to keep going and for example right here i'm going to do a little prestige here just to show you where i'm at you're going to be able to farm a lot faster than them and get that even though you don't get first place even though i'm at third place i will still easily 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 smack it out without a single problem so guys you have to measure it you have to look at the rewards and ask yourself is it worthwhile competing with the other person apart from your ego let's say for example it was only 10 procedures left nothing else to do you want to play it you want to get the first place i say 100 percent go for it however when you have a 99 prestige uh sort of event and season not season but more like an event you got to make sure you prioritize it carefully because for you to farm 99 every day will require an absolute insanity amount of time and you'll probably burn out you'll probably hit the game you'll probably never play the game after that however there'll always be some kind of special people out there that will be able to hit 99 prestigious every single day and still smash it out and still does not feel like they're gonna get bored with the game however if that is not your goal you just gotta make sure you farm properly spend the right kind of amount of time when you're tired you're done you're just like sick of it not physically tired but just more mentally like look i've done it multiple times i don't want to keep going that's all for me today. It's okay to sit there, right? Just be ready to accept the kind of results that you're gonna get and just be happy with the fact that you tried your best, right? And that's where you wanna be at because you don't wanna burn out and it's so easy to burn out in this game when you actually play too much, too repetitive to the point where you don't even wanna to touch the game at all. That can happen and will happen if you're not careful. Today I've done 26 in spite of the uh, tournament that was there, the AT. I still did 26, so my aim today is probably around 40 before I go to bed, uh, which it really isn't gonna take too much time. It'll probably take another half an hour, 10 hour, and I should be able to get there, right? So that's kind of my goal, but likelihood is I'll probably end up at 35 at maximum. What I'm doing now is I'm saving up as much as I can because I know there's a tournament going on tomorrow, which I will start tomorrow night, not to the, to tomorrow in the morning or the afternoon but i will start at night in aussie time so whatever that gmt plus this this that you figure out what that exactly works out for you but basically about 12 plus hours into the tournament or actually more like 10 to 10 to 12 hours and i'll enter into the tournament and once i enter the tournament from there i will start using it up and discover a new monument so that i can be the wheel that i have to be right so that is where i'm at and one of you subscribers did ask for my lifetime uh, stats. So guys, here it is. Uh, here's my lifetime stats. Honestly, I, I've barely seen this. I barely tried to figure this out. But if you look at my playtime, 98 days, that is just ins insane. I don't know. I don't even know what to, what to talk about, right? Um, days since installed, 2,791. Does that seem right? 365 days a year times seven. I, I, I guess, I guess it's probably. Oh, well, you guys go figure it out. Maths is not my biggest strength. I know I'm Asian. I can't even do mathematics. That's exactly what happens when you grow up in a Western world. You know, you just dumb yourself down, right? So there, there I am. Whatever this stats means to you guys, whatever it helps you with you guys, this is my all time stats and my mana stats dps stats uh, you can definitely pause it it might help you kind of figure out where you want to be at i don't want to bore the other people but uh basically these are all the different skips uh, that have changed and 
probabilities, reductions, and so forth and so forth. Um, I believe that I haven't shown my mastery. Guys, I remember when I first got back into the game, I did not even have a single full set. And here I am, uh, three, four years later, uh, with consistency, I have about 184 full sets. Uh, scrolls, this is where I am at 366 full set. And what else do we have? I think my raid levels, raid cards, um, currently at 39, 36, 34 for the ones that are on a seasonal card boost. Highest is 42. This is by far the strongest purifying blast. I do really like it uh, when it comes to the clanship barrage um, and so forth and so forth. And I do enjoy this mirror force as well. And this has been one of the sleeper builds that I reckon can be an absolute damage in the future. Um, so this is kind of where I'm at. And I'll show you a bit of the stats on my arcane bargain. So you get your all damage here, power surge, and da 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 da. These are all down here. And I, is there any other thing I can show you? Uh, build stats maybe? Is that the same thing? Yeah, I feel like this is exactly the same thing, right? Yeah, this is exactly the same thing. Uh, definitely pause it if you have to, uh, but I'm pretty sure this is the same thing. Uh, Necro Bear. Okay, maybe we can do a bit of Necro Bear. Titan Souls. I am at around here. So 23 for the greens, the purples, the blues, and then I think this is your legendary um, color. Uh, what is that? Yeah, legendary color. I don't have any mythics yet. Um, yet to discover it. I think as you keep progressing, I think that's when you start to summon them. I've been on the warlords. I've been on sorcerer. I think I'm gonna go rogue next, um, uh, just to see where I'm at with that. So, where is that forbidden research? I'm up to here. So, we just completed the bottom level. Uh, we're up to the third single one, and I'm slowly building it up. So, this is where I am, guys. Um, Hopefully that helps out with a little bit of what's going on. And guys, I got an hour to go. Uh, I hope the other two doesn't overtake me. But even if they do, it is not the biggest problem because I have already found my level 10. That is the whole point. That is the whole goal. Um, I hope I don't drop under level 4. Oh, sorry, rank 4 because it is pretty significant drop when it comes to 270 to 240. We're talking about 30 um, prestigious. However, I'm pretty sure I can spend enough that i don't have to do that because i can actually proceed from here and get that job done all right that's it for me guys let me know where you're at um i haven't reached the highest yet i haven't hit, hit 3250 but once this new one goes through the 80 and the weekend tournament i should be in the percentage level um just to show you like guys like how crazy some people are right i'm not even close to the top 10 players in my group all right people have 5850 that is just pure insanity. Uh, whether that's just his farming or whether he's using chess, mate, that, that's insane. That's just absolutely insane. Alrighty guys, I'll definitely do a bit more of a long format video in the future and I'll uh, wait for me on next Wednesday when I have a little bit more time to talk about more stuff. But I just want to give you a quick update on the AT. Looking forward to the weekend tournament and then we're going to start a fresh week of it. So be careful with how you spend your time. Don't waste your time on things that are not necessary. Make sure you spend on the right thing so that you can farm and maximize your gain, okay? Lose a battle, win the war. That's what I say. Catch you guys later. Make sure you drop a like drop a subscribe i keep forgetting to say that but that would really help me boost in the algorithm for me to be able to spread out there and keep on flying so guys keep tapping i'll catch you all later have a great weekend bye bye